Hey YouTubers, um, this is just a quick video with my iPhone 4, just to show you my firearms, just to show you them real quickly, and um, yeah, and you notice that my videos are coming out in HD, that's because I'm, that's because the iPhone 4's camera records in 1080, 720p HD, so, um, yeah, so let's turn on its light, and you can kind of see in there. You can kind of see in there. You can kind of get a quick view in there with the light. Yeah, the rest is all tied down with wire. The rest is all held down with a little screw. I don't use this one. This one I stripped out the switch for another use. So, yeah. Uh, so, let me hold on to it. Okay. Let me just find my other key. Okay, my fire light. Hang on. Oops. My fire light key. And you notice it's very worn out. I'm gonna try and find another one. So, let's just... Please excuse the sparkles on my hand. It's from my work safety vest. It's this, the reflector surface is coming off. So, one, two, three. Then, just turn the key, reset it, and then the little button inside. Yeah, everything's still the same. Still just as boring. Okay, and then my little hex thing. So, yeah. Here's my BG6. Gonna not use it much. But, um, gonna might get it a new lock. I'm not sure about getting it a new lock, but I just might get it a new lock. But if not, I'm just gonna re send it to a scrap recyclers, to a recyclers that'll be able to recycle its aluminum parts, such as its aluminum front plate and aluminum body chassis, and a metal and a steel parts like this and this. I wanna see what I wanna see what get this thing recycled. If not, I might just keep it. So um so just to move on. Here we have a stripped down Chevron. I have another one that's in that drawer somewhere. Oops! They just smacked one of my fire alarms. Okay. So let's move. And here it is, the other ship, the other strip chevron. Yeah, I made the video on me replacing the parts. I made this one a dual way. So this one, when you hook it up without a panel, you can hook up positive and negative. It has dual, now it has dual, dual mercury bulbs. So you can hook it up positive and negative to each side. Positive or negative straight connection so yeah then here's my BG's BG um, BG not, not BG but FCA MS2 there a little pulled so let me just look at it real quick it's very badly faded in some areas but it's okay I'll just thrust it down. I'll just search for my blank. My blank FCI key with no letters on it. Okay, so. so just try it. Then just. And here's this one. I can't pull this one. I cannot get it reset. I don't have the tool for it. But, um, yeah. So, yeah. You may see these in older buildings or stuff. This one actually brings back memories because my school still had these. I went to this school in on, on, the, on the island of Hawaii. My school had these yet. 
They had newer alarm system, but they still had these older pull stations. And then here's my broken BG-12. It has no switch. The contacts still can be salvaged. And the plastic chassis. I'm gonna see about getting this thing recycled too. Okay. Find a BG BG eight. Simple as that. Trying to make this quick, my phone is really low. Not low, but it's getting low on memory. So we'll just take our basic firelight key. Same firelight key as any firelight product. And we'll reset. Simplex. 2099, no, 4099-9002, should be marked 9002, but it's marked 9003 on the case, and so this one, please, and then we'll just lift up the hammer, I don't want to scratch any of this beautiful paint stuff on it, okay, and today we'll use my second bee key I got collecting fire alarms, it's my older style bee key. So yeah, you see MS2, pull position, reset position, horns, this is a wheel lock horn, the strobe plate is up there, I took it, I took the strobe off, okay, then we have my um, Edwards horn, Edwards, E4450, so, dash SF horn. It's the A1 model. It's the A1 series. Runs on DC. Runs on 20 volts DC voltage. Okay, and then simplex. My simplex. 2099. 9833. Beautiful horn. Connectors. And my 291 Yep. This is the exact same one I traded to my, uh, my friend on YouTube. I don't remember his YouTube name. But if you're watching this, hi. And now we're just going to mosey on back here. Simplex, huh? simplex horn and draw and light. Simplex, the model number 2903 <clears throat> with a 9838 on the back. And just to, sh just to show you the light, look at that. It's, <clears throat> it's light. Okay. So I hope you enjoyed this video. To my YouTube user friend, or to a YouTube friend on YouTube, here is his. Here's his name. Here's his YouTube name. I'm just saying, hi, and hope you all enjoy this video. And for the ending, we're just gonna look at my panel. So. Wrong key. Same old panel. This sucker. Fortunately, I'm going to save up my money and I'm going to buy me a new one. I'm going to buy me a brand new panel. I'm going to save up my money to give me a brand new panel. I'm going to buy me a Simplex 4010 from the company. On the island of Honolulu, on the uh, on the island of Hawaii, we have one on the on 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 Honolulu, Hawaii. So yeah, so yeah, this panel. I'm just gonna scrap it. I'm just gonna have it scrapped. When I get the new panel, that's when I'll scrap it. 
but I can still give parts away from this panel when I, whenever I get the new, whenever I can order a new panel. Look inside the, look at all those parts, all those usable parts. This is the only problem with it. That's the only problem, it's missing that piece. And that thing's broken. So, have a fun time guys. Enjoy your watch. So, yeah. Oh yeah, and Transformer's still good in this thing. It still runs well. Okay. Okay. Quick pan around my room real quick. Quick pan around the room. So, yeah. So thank you for watching. Bye.